And a jeweler is inspecting a ring that has a height of three centimeters. That will be the height of our object. By placing it 7.5 centimeters in front of a mirror. So the distance of our object is 7.5 centimeters. Remember I said that it doesn't matter if they're in centimeters or meters as long as they all match because a meter is, is really big when you're talking about a mirror or a lens. And the concave mirror is a focal length of 11.5 centimeters. Remember that if it's a concave mirror, the focal length is always positive. You're asked where will the image of the ring appear and what will the height of the image be. So you're asked to find HI and DI. It's easiest to find di first. You can use the equation. One over the focal length. Plus one over the distance of the object. Plus one over the distance of the image. We have one over 11.5 centimeters. Equals one over 7.5 centimeters plus 1 over the distance of the image. And what we're going to do is subtract this from both sides because it's being added here. So we have 1 over the distance for the image, a little 1 over 11.5 minus 1 over 7.5 and now you can put that into your calculator. You get 1 over the image distance is about negative 0.4638 and when you do that to the negative 1 or you use your x to the negative 1 or your 1 over x button you get the image be at negative 22 centimeters. This means that it is 22 centimeters inside of the mirror. And we know that it can't really be in the mirror, so this is a virtual image. And it's inside the mirror. Or it looks like it's 22 centimeters behind the mirror. Either way of wording it means the same thing. Let's talk about the height of the image. We also know that HI for HO equals negative DI over DO. We plug in, we have HI divided by 3 centimeters equals negative, and then this number is negative, 22 centimeters divided by 7.5 centimeters. Those happen to cancel out, and the two negatives cancel each other out, right? We can do 22 divided by 7.5, and then we can multiply it by 3. And we get that HI equals positive 8.8 .8 centimeters. That positive means that this image is upright. So just by doing the math, we know that our image is virtual, and we know that it is upright.